From the Tennessee Valley Weather Center, this is your evening weather update. It's been showers and thunderstorms, thunderstorms and showers across the Tennessee Valley on this Monday, especially on the Alabama side of the state line. As this frontal boundary gets into the area and stalls out, and that's going to mean scattered showers and thunderstorms around at times for much of the rest of the week. It's been a warm day today before the thunderstorms really got going. Here's the almanac data from Muscle Shoals, the Northwest Alabama Regional Airport. This is where we get the regional climate data from, upper 80s, lower 90s in southern middle Tennessee. But at the airport, Muscle Shoals, it hit 94 degrees today after morning low of 74. Records 104, though, so several degrees lower than that. Also, the record low this morning was 52. So we're much closer to average compared to the record. A little bit of rain earlier today, but more thunderstorms south of that area, south of the Tennessee River. Big bunch of thunderstorms over northwest Alabama. Those will fade away with time as we head deeper into the evening and then partly to mostly cloudy as we head through the overnight. Maybe some lingering showers, though, mainly over north Alabama. And then there's the chance of some additional isolated redevelopment toward daybreak, morning lows in the upper 60s. Lower 70s across the area, and tomorrow, the 4th, unfortunately, it's going to be one of those days where, yes, the better chance of rains in the afternoon and evening, but scattered thunderstorms could form at any time, and they may be fairly widespread across the area tomorrow as well. There will be a time where you can get in outdoor activities, but you're going to have to pay attention to the radar and watch for when thunderstorms move in. Lightning, a big, big concern tomorrow, so if you hear thunder, go indoors, be inside away from windows. Scattered showers and thunderstorms still around as we head through the middle and latter part of the week, but they do become more ice isolated as we had Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday into the weekend. Fortunately, we're not talking about that big time heat we had late last week into the past weekend. Upper 80s, lower 90s will be the daytime highs for the next five to seven days. Morning lows not too far from 70 degrees. About what you should expect this time of year across Tennessee Valley. We're watching the tropics, but not a lot going on. Remember, the Atlantic hurricane season runs all the way through the end of November. Partly cloudy skies after evening showers and thunderstorms fade away. Maybe an isolated shower or a thunderstorm overnight, otherwise fog after midnight, especially where you saw rain today, and then showers and thunderstorms scattered, but picking up again for our Tuesday, our 4th of July here, highs in the upper 80s, lower 90s over southern middle Tennessee, with scattered showers and thunderstorms, more of the same in northwest Alabama, upper 80s and lower 90s. Here's your seven-day forecast from the Tennessee Valley Weather Center, and I forgot to move my decoration for the 4th, so let's pretend like it's over on Tuesday, but upper 80s, lower 90s the next seven days, partly sunny with scattered showers and and thunderstorms each day more widespread Tuesday than maybe again on Thursday but no chance of rain being zero there the next seven days there's a look at your seven-day forecast I'll be back at nine o'clock with another check of your local weather